guys. It's slow going today. That's a pretty good little spot though. Fatter than fall fat. A little football. Well, you know what I'm using. Vision 110 Junior, plus one, Tennessee Shaft. The Table Rock Go-To is what I'm gonna start calling it. Boy, it's cold, guys. I mean, it's super cold. Sun's out, though, so it's starting to warm up a little bit. But, wow, makes it hard to stay motivated, that's for darn sure. I mean, look at that. You guys can see the ice on the reel. The ice and the guides. I mean, it's just cold. Interesting part is, water is 46. That fish was in less than 10 foot of water. That's kind of crazy, I know, but that's where he was, about 10 foot. you know it's cold out wherever you get back from fishing and there's icicles on your trailer and that's whenever you're going home after it's warmed up yeah it's cold hey guys Jason Riker crazy blessed fishing went out today for a couple hours before church froze to death I mean it was just cold downright cold looks like we're in for a pretty good warm-up next week which boy i'm glad of because man this cold snap we had the cold rain on friday and then saturday and then today it just today it started warming up later this afternoon but yeah it it was bad uh, as you guys can see earlier in the video stuck one fish day on a jerk bait vision 110 plus one junior uh, Tennessee Shad, my normal go-to bait. I will tell you, though, I saw a lot of fish, and I didn't catch one on it, but the X Nanahan, I have high hopes for this bait. It's a little bit shorter than the Vision 110 Junior plus one. This is an X Nanahan plus two. Runs about seven to eight foot deep. Had multiple fish. It was hard to lay that one down today because whenever they'd come up off the bottom for it, I mean, they were coming like a ball of fire. Never did have one eat it, but boy, I mean, whenever they'd run up, they'd run up fast to look at it. Not quite sure what that means, but they would not commit. But man, they were coming up fast. I really, there was a couple of times I thought, okay, this one's definitely going to smash it. And just nothing. Also threw a rock crawler just a little bit today. I just didn't have much hope for it with it being as cold as it was. Water temp was 45, 8 to 46, 2 by the time I left. Just cold, 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 cold. Anyways. Guys, I, I really appreciate all the subscribers last week. I wished I had more information for you, but that's all I've got this week. Jerkbait bite was slow. Just fishing is going to be slow. I think next weekend we ought to, with this warm-up coming, we're going to hit 75 one day this week. Next weekend's going to be in the mid to high 60s on the weekend. I think it's going to be a great day for fishing. I, I'm really looking forward to it. Going to fish both days next week. So we'll give you guys an update on that. But, hey... This week had more subscribers than I've ever had, so be sure and hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet. And also be sure and hit the like button, guys. I'm, I'm really happy with where this is going. I hope you guys are too. Trying to get as much feedback to you guys whenever you ask questions as I can. 
as soon as I can. I missed one this week. I apologize for that. It took me about four days to get back to you. Apologize for that. I try and get back sooner than that. Anyways, guys, that's all I've got this week. So have a blessed week, and we'll talk to you soon. And next week, we'll go fishing and see how we do.